If you're having trouble loading into Windows and want to perform a factory reset, make sure that your computer is powered completely off, then power it back on, and as soon as you see the rotating loading circle, hold your power button down until your computer shuts off. You'll need to turn your computer back on and repeat this same process two or three times until you see this preparing automatic repair message. This time, let your computer load without powering it off and you'll be brought into this automatic repair screen. From here, click Advanced Options, and then click Troubleshoot. You have two recovery options. Refresh your PC may help get your computer running again without causing you to lose any of your files, and is usually a good place to start. If that doesn't work, you can completely reset your PC to factory defaults, which is a more complete recovery, but you'll lose any personal files and applications that you've put on your computer. For this video, I'm going to use Reset Your PC. Go ahead and click it, and you'll be brought to a screen letting you know that all of your files are going to be removed. Click Next, and you'll see two options for removing your files. Fully clean the drive is more secure, but it takes quite a while longer. In most cases, just remove my files should be fine, which is what I'm going to use. Click it, and then click Reset to start the process. It may take 20 or 30 minutes, depending on your model, and once it's done, your computer will load into Windows and let you go through the first time setup. If you have any questions, please visit our website, www.acer.com.